Hey everybody. I got my new iPad. Yay! Hopefully it come, looks a lot better. I don't know. It's all got the newfangled stuff on it. Anyway, it is bath time for the silicones. It's been a while since they've had a bath and I thought that we would do a video on them getting a bath. Happy Valentine's Day. Today is Friday the 14th. And look at that. So I thought I'd bring you along to give these two a bath. Their tub right here. I've got um, both blind, um, towels right here in here. And I've got their powder. I've got some little toys, their brushes. Um, they don't have hair, so, but I've got, I don't put, um, I put powder on them. And I got a washcloth in here. So I think that we are all set. What else do I got in here? Oh, a, a nose thing. If I need it, shampoo, baby wash. I got two washcloths, actually three. I don't know why I have three, but I've got a few. So now we just got to go pick them out some clothes and we will give them a bath. So we will be right back. Okay, I'm back. That took me a little bit. All their clothes is buried. <laughs> so I got them an outfit and I'll show you that when I clean them up, but they're, I haven't changed them yet. There's the tub. We're up in my kitchen, the kitchen sink. So I've got a couple, don't mind the mess a little bit. I've got a part soaking for my husband and I just did dishes and the pan's got to dry. So I've got the bag right here. I use mine as a bath bag, but you can use it as a changing bag too, you know, put clothes in it and whatnot. But for the Reborns, I just decided to do um, a bath bag. So it has their towels, powder, washcloths, their bath stuff, and there's some toys in here, like some little froggies and little duckies, um, a brush for the other Reborns, I've got their powder brush, and this is great. Um, my other ones, the bristles shed and get all over them. This is from e.l.f., and it's a kabuki. It's just a little teeny one, but I find it works great for them, and Ariel got sparkles on them. So there's my little brush for them. That goes in here, and I got a bottle of water, spray water, for the um, other babies, the Reborns, because some of them have hair. And I'll do another bath time with them, with one of them. I have a video already up with one of them, but I'll do another one. I'll see if I can find it and see who it's with. So I set this right here for the bath thing and I'll get their bath ready and be right back. And this is from Trend Lab. I got it off of Poshmark. Somebody was selling it and it had little leaves all over it. It's cute, it's gray, so it'll go with anything. So I'll be right back, get these guys out of their clothes and into the tub. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Got them all ready. Gonna, I've got um, Baby Magic. Um, hair and body wash, a soft powder smell. I don't think it smells like that at all, but it's, um, I like the Johnsons, always have, and I'll probably stay with that. And so let's wash these Zeta ones up. I'm going to have to get a big bottle of it because I'm using up all my trial size stuff. And... I want to get um, a big one. So the last one, like I did the powder. And the powder, I'll show you when I get them changed. Let me move out of the way so you can see. And he's, he's all dopey. Let's cover up his little part part because he is um, atomically correct. And Gonna clean that up a little bit. Ariel gave him a bath and 
got him full of powder, so now he's nothing but powder. And he's such a cute boy. I've been thinking about these guys a lot the last couple of days. I'm like, I need to give them a bath and snuggle with them. Okay, you hang on to that, okay? Let's get this out of your eyes. You hang on to that, dude. Now her turn. And, uh, but I had to give them a bath. How's everybody like, if you have silicones, how do you like them? I mean, mine aren't from a, an artist, but that's because it'd take me forever to save up money for one. So I went with the inexpensive version, which is still expensive. They were just under $100 each. And I begged Ariel to be very careful with these guys because they were still expensive even though they were inexpensive, you know. Just to see if I was even going to like the silicone. And it has pros and cons. I mean, the, you can give them a bath. Um, the realism of them, well, these guys aren't too bad. Um, but... Um, I can't imagine one from an actual artist. I don't know about the paint, but these Ibita dolls, like I opened up their mouths, and each time you give them a bath or whatever, some of the paint comes off. So, you know, and I'm not gonna repaint her or him. So if the paint comes off, the paint comes off. I don't know how to get what kind of paint to use on them to whatever. But we don't play with them all the time. Ariel does a little bit, but I like to give them, she likes to give them a bath. She likes to do that. And I think she's done it on Instagram, at our Tiny Toes Instagram. But I don't know. So how's that guys? Y'all clean y'all, huh? Yeah. We'll get y'all. I guess it has a little leak in it. So we'll let the water out. This has a little thing in it. And you put it in the sink here and you can open it up and and let it drain. And then I flip it upside down for a couple hours. So let's put her in her and let her washcloth dry. Come here, girly. And she's got a little, here we go. There she is. All nice and clean and warm and snuggly. And it's a big towel on her because she's a preemie. Look at her. She's so cute. She's still wet. Huh? And then this is baby. Emma, and I pat her dry because, because of her paint, because I don't want to rub it anymore, but here you go, girls, look at that, she's all snuggly, we will put her down so we can get them dressed next, so let me go, let me put her down. Her over here, lay her down, and let's get Mr. Man out, Mr. Evan, my boy, and he's got a little doggy towel. This is for the, all the babies, actually. So, he's so cute. Okay, dude, let's get you covered. Let's get you covered. He's all covered. Look at him, all snuggly. <laughs> Oh, his face is adorable. I found, looking at all the Ivitas on eBay, because I got them off of eBay, um, his little face I fell in love with. He's got these little dimples. My Asia, she has dimples like this. I mean, prominent show up, you know. But isn't he all cutie? It's all cutie boy, huh? Yes. 
Okay, let's go put you with your sister. Yeah, oh my goodness. Yeah, they're just calling for me to snuggle with them. And trying to get, get this rinsed out and put back. I try to do that after I'm done with them. And these are gonna dry. And I will put them right there. And then I will tip this up like that so it will finish draining. So, okay, we will be, well, I'll be right back. You can't see me. <laughs> I'll be right back in a few minutes and get them all situated and we'll change them and get them all cozied up for later. I'll see you in a little bit. Okay, I brought them into my room and I put um, my blanket that I, we come in here and watch movies at night and stuff after Ariel goes to bed, you know. So this is Jeff's little blankie, my husband. And I keep it on top of my, my, um, my checker, checkered one because the dog gets up here. So I just assume have the blankets down, but I turned this one over for the dolls. I got his stuff already, his little outfit and her little outfit right here. Daisy's going to come in every time I'm with the baby. She has, see, she, she's right there, see? <laughs> she has to be part of it. But I'm going to have these guys all wrapped up and keep them in the Moses basket over here. Let me show you. Excuse my little corner here. But I got the Moses basket right here. I took the um, bumper pad out because I'm working with my new baby buggy. And I think I'm going to put that in there. And I'll make a different one for in here. But I've got this up here for, for them to lay in tonight. So, okay. Let's get them dressed. I don't know. I can't get you guys even closer. I, I guess I could if I put you on the bed. Um, how's that? And Miss Daisy has to be right there. So let's um, move his stuff over. I decided to put him in blue and pink because it's my little boy and my little girl. So let's um, kind of unwrap her keep the blanket on her because I'm going to be using powder and we are going to let's see I have that other washcloth right here we are going to cover, cover her up there now she's really sticky right now because I just washed her I mean she's sticky so what I do is I put a bunch of powder on the blanket or whatever. I don't sprinkle it on them. I dab it on them. But this is the one I get. It's Tippy Toes. I think that I got this from Walmart. It's either Walmart or I got it at Family Dollar. But it's got, um, it doesn't have any of that um, talc in it. It's corn, pure cornstarch. So... That's what I use on them. So I just put some on the brush and just put it on her. I, I noticed that with these guys, I have to kind of put a lot. And this is the No Name brand. And I'm just a sucker for Johnson & Johnson. I don't like the smell of these other powders. I think they stink. I don't smell like baby powder, no. So I will get all her crevices. I'll try to anyway. So she is not sticky anymore. And after you give them a bath and powder them, these guys tend to stay um, pretty soft for a while. I mean, she was starting to get a little sticky but not too bad but they they needed a bath Ariel hasn't done it 
in a while. So my turn. And it kind of soaks up and she's gonna look awful for a minute because I put a ton on her face. In her ears. Then she's, then she's cute. And she's all nice and soft. There. I don't know what he's barking at. Lately, you make a, just a little bit of a, any kind of knocking or something, and he just freaks out. Dopey dog. Let's put this on your feeties, girl. I see why, I don't know, some of these, I mean, their feet are really cute, but they're not separated because you can very easily could rip them. So, yeah, and you don't want that. I mean, one of her hands is kind of, she's got one finger and a thumb that is separated. And you have to be careful when you dress them because you can't pull on them. Because they will rip. Okay, what I do is the front part, but this little thingy, nose thingy, if you push up, it blows air. And I try to get the air out but sometimes it doesn't work and I have to do it the hard way I did um, her eyes I made I opened up her mouth and I put too much powder up in her eye area looks good there and she's got some on her nose and I've got it all over me which is fine now let's flip her over the only thing that is hard with these guys is that their head goes face down there it's not movable here and which makes it kind of Um, hard to, you know, set them up correctly for pictures and stuff. See, her head went face down. So you have to. Now she's all smooth. Huh. Now you're all smooth, girl. Cover up your bum. You don't want to get in trouble. Okay. Now she's all nice and soft. And she's still got, she's going to have powder on her for a while. You just have to keep doing that. And she has, I got her, this was Ariel's, a pink silicone binky. And I put powder on it before I put it in her mouth. And let's put your diaper on. Preemie diapers fit them really well. And I'm gonna step in front of you for a second. So, sorry about that. And I usually, for the authenticity of it, I will put some powder on her little butt. And they have the little belly button thing. And because they're preemies, actually these guys are probably considered, they're between a preemie and a micro preemie. Um, yeah, so she's, she's got her daddy on, she's good. 
So we'll put her softies on, their little hearts, because today is Valentine's Day. And we'll put her little socks on, because I'm going to, they're pretty much going into their, it's their day clothes, but it's jammies. I got a sack, and it's got little hearts all over it, and it's so, 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 so cute. So, and I probably put a, should put a t-shirt on her, but I'm not going to. I'm just going to put this on her. And these guys, you pretty much have to dress like you would an actual baby, a human baby, because you cannot pull on their arms. So when you're getting them dressed, you got to do the same thing. Put your hand in here. Kind of grab it. And okay, girl. Let's let's put this on you. She's so 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 cute. Lay down. Kind of a little bit big. Some of the preemie stuff fits really well and other stuff doesn't like some stuff is just a little bit too big and this little sleeper sleep nighty has the hand things on it Let's see she's so you can tell she's real powdery and we will fix that oh she smells so good hmm Ah. Yeah, she does. She smells so good. So let's move her towel out of the way. We got her. Now you, you could probably like twist this or whatever, but I'm just going to kind of put it up underneath her. And let's put her bink in. Try to get it in. I don't think I cut deep enough for her mouth, and it kind of takes up her mouth a little bit. And she's got a little hat with hearts on it that we are going to put on her. show them what you look like so here she is oh she's adorable and her eyelashes let me get that wet so you can it looks more normal there there she is there isn't she cute and see so it doesn't quite go in all the way but it does. Okay. Now, let's put her down. And I got a swaddle for her. And I don't think I've even used this yet. I may have. It, and it's got the same colors as her nighty that she's got on. And let's, uh, I kind of swaddle the old fashioned way. And as a new way, I don't really have that down, but I kind of do the old fashioned way. You put it kitty corner, and because this is so big, I will kind of fold it up. I will put her, I want to try to swaddle her where her arms are up, but I don't know how that's going to work. sleeves are coming down. Okay, let's fix them. Let's fix them. There you go. And wrap her up. There. There she is. See, she's kind of all wrapped up. 
and I got her arms out. There. Now we will do her brother. Whoops. Isn't she cute? Isn't she cute? Aw, sweet little Emmy. All right. Let's put her kind of sideways, and I'll show you them inside the... Um, thing here after I get him dressed. <sighs> okay, dude. Look at all this powder. Your turn, Mr. Mister. It's his turn. He's so cute. Okay. Let's get you all dressed, dude. Okay, let's cover up your manly parts. And we'll do the same thing with him. And I think his jacket or his little jersey is up. We will put powder on his dink. And we'll put some powder on this towel here. All right. He's so cute. I'm glad that I bought him. I bought one, I think for my birthday. And she, I mean, they wanted like a hundred and it was under 150 and I wasn't willing to pay that. So I kept going back and forth with whoever it is. And, um, I didn't want to pay, uh, you know, I was, I was willing to pay 80 bucks. So I put in for $80 and they countered with, I think 89 or something. And I did that, but I, they were really good working with me and everything. So I tried, I decided when, after I got him, this is the one that stunk real bad. Ugh, he doesn't smell like that anymore. Thank goodness. And, um, I wanted to go back through the same seller. Well, they I wanted to get the girl version of this and they sold out with the lady, well, whoever I had anyways, they sold out. So I had to go with somebody else and they weren't willing as much to work with me as far as price goes. I mean, I don't expect nothing, you know, but I didn't want to pay a hundred bucks. So I think I got, I got him for like 89 and I got her for like 90. It was still under a hundred bucks, but I still thought it was too much. I didn't want to spend that, but you're going to spend 80 something on a real nice kit, like from McPherson's or whatever. You're going to pay maybe on sale under a hundred dollars for a kit, you know? So I kind of justified it that way, but I mean, I love these guys, and I probably won't ever sell them, but I don't know if I would get a silicone. They're a lot of work. They're just like, almost like a baby, other than you don't have to feed them, you know, but you do have to bathe them, and you have to be careful with them. And, you know, if that was the only one I had, then maybe, I don't know. I like my Reborns. I, I could never give up Tanner. And, but I think these, I don't know if I'll end up getting like a bigger silicone. Like, I'll still probably go with another Ivita. I'd like to go with the same seller as these guys. And um, get a bigger one, you know, more of a newborn size. But they're like a hundred and Oh, that could be $200, I think $180, 90 something like that for one of them. So I don't know. I, if I feel like I can justify it, then I will. I've got a couple of um, Reborns that I'm getting almost done painting. And maybe as soon as I sell them, I will get one with that money. If I don't have, uh, unless a stinking bill comes up or something, I have to use the money for but 
usually everything I make with the Reborns goes back into the Reborns. Once in a while, I've had to pay the electric bill and that kind of thing. But, you know, life goes on. All right, dude. I love his toes. Oh, my gosh. His toes are gorgeous. I'll show you them. I've shown you them before. But I love his other tootsies. Look at his little toes. Oh, my gosh. Look. They are separated. Except for the three. His pinky is. So cute. And his little big toe. But the three in the middle are not. Oh, my gosh. I love them. They are so, so down this on the other foot, it's not his big toe separated, but his little toe isn't. But I love his feet. I should do a Instagram post with his little feet. Oh my gosh, I love him. He's so cute. He's pretty close second for Tanner. You know, I nothing will take the place of my Mr. Tanner, but... Okay, dude. Let's flip ya. I hate having his face in the in the blanket like that. Let's uh let's put a little put a little powder on ya. We'll use what's left on the blanket here. See his face turned already. His butt. Get it, bums. That was so cute when I got him. Ariel was like, "Mom, can I see him? Can I see him?" I said, "Yep." Yeah. She goes, "Can I give him a bath?" She wanted to give him a bath right away. And she undressed him, and she's like, "Mom, he has boy parts." <laughs> it was so cute. I said, "Yes, he does." You gotta be very careful with these dollies. Look at his little feet. Look. So cute. Love him. Love him, love him, love him. Okay, dude. Let's put your daddy on. I'm gonna reuse the one he had on because it's fine. And it's an honest diaper. And I really, see his paint. I don't know if you can see, look. That's from the first time putting him on and some of his paint because he was really red when we got him. Okay, dude, let's fold that over. Let's put you a little bit of powders in here. And this doll anyway, isn't circumcised so he's a boy but they don't they didn't make him like he's he's not circumcised so you see he's <laughs> see he's all powder and yet I clean up his face after let's move that out of the way and we will Shiny, huh? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's so cute. There, I got the powder out of his eyes. <laughs> Took it on your head, though. But all right, so let's get him his. His little, and these have little middies in them, so I didn't have to put um, mitts on them. I gotta sell some stuff off of Poshmark so I can go shopping. I need to get boy girl preemie outfits that match or similar to and girl girl to go with Keegan and Kayla and for B 
these guys for Emma and Evan. There you go, dude. Yeah. Move that new up. He's so cute. So how's every what's everybody doing for Valentine's Day? My husband wanted to take me out, but he doesn't get he drives two and a half hours home. And he wanted to take me out to dinner. But after working all day and all of that, I don't want him to drive again. So we're gonna have a Valentine's dinner at home. He's gonna he's gonna cook a steak, I think. Ariel will be here, of course, so. And we've always had date night with her ever since she was a baby, so it's fine. It's all good. And then this weekend, I want to finish painting those two dolls so I can start rooting hair. Oh, aren't you just adorable? This hat's going to be a little big on him because it's newborn. But he's kind of got a big head. So he is up cute. Yes, you are. Oh, my goodness. Look. Okay. He's got his... It's a little polar bear and little polar bear feeties. And he's got his middies so his hands won't get yucky. His little face, got his hat on. He needs another wipe on his face. Ah. All right. Let's put the stuff over here. We're done with the powder. And we're done with this stuff. Let's put your bink in. I have powder left over on the blanket here. Looks like you're torturing them when you put these binkies in their mouth because you have to squeeze their cheek. Alright, let's show everybody. Here he is. There's powder on everything that will come off. So let's wrap him up. Let's wrap him up. I didn't have a plain baby blue blanket or cute one like she had. So we're going to use the elephant one. And we're going to wrap him the same way. I use the old fashioned way. I always take that down, put him right there. I'm going to do the same thing with him as I did with her. I want her, his hand out, so I will put, leave that out, leave that one out, and there he is, so, so cute, and now he will go with his sister over here in the Moses bed, so let's turn you over here, you can barely see her. There you go. Oh, she's already fast asleep. So they will stay there with me tonight. I'll probably go down and get another blanket to put over this. So that our, excuse me, it's not cold up here. So, well, thanks guys for coming for, uh, let's see, I'll get down so you can see me. Um, for giving them a bath and that was fun they're all nice and cozy now I get to cuddle with them she's the one that my husband likes he really likes her and you know some of them he he likes and some of them he doesn't so that's about it so any comments leave them down below thanks for watching welcome new subscribers I know I've gotten a few more um, I appreciate it and we will see you all again in the next video. Bye now.